Thank you for rocking with me. Now, people keep telling me to do a review of Coming to America 2, so that's what I'm going to do. Cool. Now, if you haven't seen it, keep it pushing. But for those who know about the plot, Eddie Murphy has a son in New York because he had a one-night stand with an Amazon chick because he got drunk from the scene that they went to the party looking for a woman. That same scene where the, the two twins, one of the DJs want to taste my breast, that same scene, they left to the spit out, got a jump in, and he smashed the Amazon chick. Now, I don't know what type of real shit they trying to come up with, but ain't nobody fucking that Amazon chick. I don't give a fuck. I don't care about no drugs, no Hennessy. Nobody could get hard for that. That's with all respect, but you know what time it is, Sugar Leslie. You know that. Ain't nobody y'all funky like that. Keep it funky. That's cool. But that's the plot, right? He had sex with her, came back to the, his Zemunda, and then come to find out they have a son together. Cool. They're supposed to be in the hood. Now, with all that said, I want to talk about someone that was missing. Fuck that. They brought everybody back. They brought the barbers. They brought the, the singer nigga. They brought <laughs> Randy Watson from the... What's going down episode of That's My Mama. They brought him back. They brought, They even brought the two girls. All the DJs want to kiss my breast. Whatever the fuck they say. I want to kiss their breast. I know that's not the lyric, but that's what it is. I want to talk about the sister of his wife. Where is she at? Where's the jump off? She's a jump. Where did she go? Let's talk about where did the puppy? There was a puppy in part one. Where did the puppy go? They fucking up, man. They fucking up. They brought everybody back except for the puppy and the Jerry Curl nigga. I don't know. I don't know if he's dead or not. So glow nigga. Where he at? I don't know. That's neither here nor there. Now, I want to talk about the fact that they got Roll Timmy. Ain't Roll Timmy a big dog? How you going to give him like a little small role? They brought him in the movie, and then later on, I see his nose making appearance. They came at two separate times. They should have made him come in at one time. He tried to get two checks. One for him and the other check for his nose. That's what they did. I don't know. Rotimi got a couple of dollars, though, I bet. Two paychecks and all that. Michael Blackson should have had a bigger role. Because that nigga's wild funny, wild black. And he looked like Zemunda as a whole. If you look up Zemunda, it looked like him. Cool. That's all love. Tracy Morgan could have had a better role. His, he wasn't that funny. If you want to talk about who had the best role is the big Amazon chick. Leslie, I think her name is. She killed it. Every line she gave, they gave her, it was funny. Every line. Now, I want to give a special shout out to Wesley Snipes' haircut in that movie. If you watch that movie, please go look at his haircut again. And peep another thing about Wesley. Peep the way he skips in the room every time he walks in. Peep that. Wesley killed that role, man. He's funny. He's funny. So Wesley Snipes is another nigga that's supposed to have an arranged marriage with Eddie Murphy's son. So his daughter is supposed to have an arranged marriage with Eddie Murphy's son, which is the lead role in the movie. Guess who this nigga daughter is? This nigga daughter is Tiana Taylor. Tiana Taylor with the six pack and big lips and cheeky eyes. Tiana at Tiana, right? Now, I don't give a fuck what nobody's saying. The dude in the movie fell in love with his, the chick that was cutting his hair. When I drop to a Caesar, my, I don't need you. I'm going back to Tiana. Yo, Tiana looks so fucking good that there's no way a nigga could pass that up. I don't give a fuck. I wanted to just reach through the screen, grab her lips, and put it in my pocket. Just put it in my pocket just to have it for myself for later because she's wild bad. She had like the little six pack. She's good. And the nigga passed her up to fall for real love for the chick that was doing his hair, right? He had a chick that was doing his hair. That's who he fell in love with. He took the chick from Zemunda that he was doing his hair and brought her back to Queens and got married in a little jump off church. I saw love. I get it. But the ultimate plot of the movie to me is like everybody got to do what works for you. You know what I'm saying? It's okay to change the rules in order to make people happy. To me, that's what I got. You know what I'm saying? Eddie Murphy changed the the actual, um, how you want to call it, tradition by having his daughter take the heir to the throne. Because he had a daughter. He had three daughters. I don't know what the purpose of having three daughters and, and if only one was an interest in the movie. So she was trying to get the position that the young 
son was getting to take over the the, the um the Zemunda. So I guess that was the all in all message to the movie. You can do what you want to do, change the rules. It's all love. Everybody got to do what they got to do to make things run. You don't have to follow the tradition. You don't have to. You can make your things happen the way you want it to happen. That's the main plot I got. I don't know what y'all got from it, but that's the message I got. You know what I'm saying? So other than that, it, it was good. You know what I'm saying? The singer, the uh, uh, Randy Watson was, in, was on deck. The two twins was on deck. The pastor was on deck. Everybody, they brought pretty much everybody, except for the puppy and the jump off of the, the chick sister. Those are the only two people they didn't bring back. They brought Whack Arnold's back. They brought everything. Oh, no, McDowell's. They brought McDowell's back. So it was good. All in all, I enjoyed the movie. Make sure when you see it, you see it with people that's going to make you laugh. That's going to make you, you know what I mean? Put, bring the vibes up. You want to make sure you bring the vibes up, you know? But... That's it.